Hello everybody, my name is Luchara, and this is Across the Obelisk. We're doing a fresh run. We just finished uh, a run where we, we won, we beat the main boss. So let's try a fresh run. With that in mind, we are going to do a different mage though. We're going to do Cornelius instead of Evelyn. So we don't have any traits with Cornelius. So that's going to be a bit of a challenge. So it'll make it a little harder, but we have some traits we can spend on our other people though. So let's see here. Go, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, sure. I don't want to spend too much time on this. Uh, bleed, poison. Yeah, we'll go, go with that. Uh, hmm. Do I want speed? No. There. Alright, let's get into it. Begin adventure. We're not going to do a new game plus. Not there yet. I'd like to unlock some more stuff. Get a little bit better. So actually, I'm going to gonna change my deck around here, but I am going to put a timestamp in. If you don't want to see the deck building part, if you just want to see the first battle, check the uh, description or the timestamp and you can skip ahead. But if you do want to see the deck building, let's do this. All right, so let's do let's do a town upgrade first. We might be able to make stuff cheaper. No, so we've got that lower. We can transform cards. Not too interested in that. Cost of divination divination rounds is reduced. Cost of reroll items in the town inventory is reduced. Unlock the caravan node outside the starting town. I'm I I don't know what that means. <laughs> so I think I'm actually going to take this so we can find out what that means. All right, so let's check for gear here anything good what do we got small weapon man speed is nice no resistance that's a pretty solid uh armor we're gonna put that on magnus for 200 sure he's already got a good uh fire staff otherwise i would buy this reduce the cost of one random song in your hand by one until discarded meh in one extra energy at the start of the turn. That's pretty good. Let's give that to give that to him. Yeah. Do a quick reroll. We have a lot of money here. We'll do one reroll. Okay, okay, I like this. For Andrin. So put that on Andrin. I want to try this sometime, but it seems risky to me. <laughs> What's Bass do? Draw one, grant two, heal three. Yeah, we'll take that. Take that on Magnus. Thorns. More tankiness. Oh, let's, let's make Reginald a little more tanky. Sure. I know it's a marginal upgrade, but it's still an upgrade. All right, so let's uh, let's make some cards. What do we want to do here? Last time I went with more of a a blunt damage deck, and it worked pretty well. I think I might try that again. What is this? Oh wow, that's really good in a blunt deck. <laughs> Cost three. It's tough right now. Later on, we'll be able to make that cheaper. Maybe we'll buy that in the second town. Right? So where's my blunt stuff? Basically, I'm looking for... Uh, not this. I mean, that is good, but... We're looking for... doo doo, -doo. <laughs> This is good. Pommel. We're looking for pommels. So we can buy two pommels. Well, we're going to buy an extra piercing howl as well. Couple of punches. And a pommel. Or pulverize. Do a pulverize. We don't want to spend too much money though, or too many shards. And shield bash. We'll do we'll buy two shield bashes. I am a big shield bash fan. Alright, so let's go in. Let's remove some cards now. We don't need these fast strikes. We've replaced those essentially. 
We want to get down back down to close to 15 cards. A couple extras, okay. We'll get rid of the Rens as well. All right, so that brings us to 17 cards. We want to get rid of a Depend. Yeah, let's get rid of one Depend. That's 16 cards. That's a good amount for him. All right, so now let's look at uh, some cards for Andrin. Generally, I'm probably not going to make a lot of changes to his deck. I mean, I'll upgrade some stuff. I'm going to grab one extra Deflect. I do like Deflect a lot. And what else do we want to do? Just look here. Try to find some stuff that was really good for us. I love this card, but it's expensive. But I love it too much. We're buying it. As you can tell, I'm a big fan of Vulnerable. <laughs> but, so we're going to have to get rid of some expense cards. These Ruptures will have to go. For sure. What, is there anything we want to replace Slice with? Probably not. Might also grab... Um, what's it called? The flaming shot or whatever. Actually, we should probably get this because it gives crack. Let's get that. Crack is good because our Magnus does blunt damage. And since our mage is going with a fire deck, right? I can't. I don't see it though. Where is it? Right here, burning shot. That would mean we had two, three cost cards. And I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> if I'm being honest. So we're not going to do that. Let's see what, what is this here for two cost cards. We might replace some of these aim shots. Um, That's the thing though. There's not a lot of great things I find for him. With two costs. There's some solid one cost. Oh, Ricochet is pretty good. Let's get a Ricochet. Alright, now let's take get rid of a couple cards here. So we're going to get rid of... One of the ruptures. We'll hold on to one rupture. Get rid of a couple aim shots. I don't care as much about the bleed, but I want the slow, right? And let's get rid of one slice. Okay. Now for Cornelius. His deck's pretty solid already because we're going with the fire deck. Right? And he's already got a lot of fire stuff, but... There are some stuff. I don't like this card particularly. Or this card particularly. Or this card particularly. So we're going to have to replace those. So let's get some flares first. Or fire blast. Flares, the two cost card. Two flyer blasts. So we need... What was it? What do they say? Four cards I wanted to replace? Yeah, and they're all cheap cards, though. So let's get... What else is cheap? Well, we can get uh, an Ember Storm. Two Ember Storms, but that puts our cost up, right? Our average cost goes up by... We're not average cost. Our total cost of our deck goes up by one. All right, so all that stuff's gone. We're back down to 15. All right, now let's... Actually, you know what? I should have done Divination first. All right, I should have done it first. Because, for example, this Ricochet. This is obviously better than the Ricochet I just bought. And we get a Pommel. And a Ricochet. And... Mm, Curse of Elements, no, we'll pass. And for him... Grant a Buffer, Dispel, Poison. That's pretty good, but it's not a lot of stuff that deals poison right now. I mean, the buffer's good. It's more of a later in the game card. We'll pass on it for now. And we'll do one more basic divination. See if we get anything good. And yeah, we'll pass there. See, deflect. I could have gotten deflect for free. Oh, well. We'll take the fire blast. And... No. No, we'll just take shards there. Alright, so let's take a look at Reginald's stack here. I think we're gonna get rid of the foresights. They're good when you're learning, but I'm just I'm not big on foresight. But we'll need some cheap cards to replace them. 
So we'll get another healing rain. And what? Probably look at some one cost stuff here. I mean, we can make these splashes free though too, right? I'm gonna go with the dispel magic. And I think I'll go with Sunbeam. So let's go with two Sunbeams. If we're going with the Heavy Fire deck, right? I think that makes sense. Go for Reggie. We're going to take out two Foresights. Excuse me. And we're going to take out one Flash. And what? Let's take out a Heal. We're also going to buy. I want at least one big hitting card. Extra Holy Smite or Extra Holy Nova. Hmm. Is there anything else that deals fire for him? I'll go to three cost. X equals tar See, that could be good. But I don't think our deck's quite there yet do like this yeah let's grab one of those just for fun all right so let's uh let's upgrade some cards Magnus intercept we'll just do the we want to keep this free preferably punch I'd rather not I like having the flexibility to, to hit not necessarily the front monster with Magnus or with anybody for that matter. Now we gotta be careful. We only have so much, so many shards though, right? So we're gonna make one of these defense free and then we'll make this one better. And hmm. yeah, let's make better there too. Piercing Howls. It's a pretty small upgrade for 153, so we're not going to upgrade those right now. We are going to upgrade these pommels, though. We are not going to make them more expensive. We'll actually we'll upgrade two of them, maybe later, when we've leveled up and we can our stuff is cheaper, we can do this one. Not right now. We will upgrade Barricade. Barricade is a huge, huge one. And Pulverize... And we'll hold up on that. Shield Bass we will do, though. Do one. Alright, so that's all for him. Um, what about Deflects? I do like this upgrade, but it's 153. Let's see if we can find some of the cheaper ones instead. Like slice, let's make... Let's do Free Slice. And we'll do Slice that applies Merrick. And aim shot, we will make a cheaper aim shot. And we will make a better aim shot. Ricochet costs a bit much. Rupture costs a bit much. Yeah, let's do this. We yeah, we got some shards to play with. Alright, Cornelius definitely upgrading the fire blasts. To, to add burn. We want to burn. This is a burn deck. At least twice. Maybe the Maybe the last one will just put some extra damage on. Roll of Intellect. Those are pretty expensive. We're not going to upgrade those. So I'm going to do this one. Most of our upgrades are going to be on Cornelius. He's going to be our kind of our priority. Oh, I just remembered something. That store. Lamey on Cornelius. Casting Fire Ember, Fire Ember for free every turn. Yeah, that's awesome. I almost forgot to grab the pet. That would have been bad. All right, so we're currently upgrading Cornelius' cards. These are cheap. We will do these. We want more burn instead of more. We'll do we'll do two of the more burn dam um, ones, and we'll do one of the more damage. Flare, we do not want to make it more expensive. Well, thank you. So we will just do this one right down the line. And fireball. We will go with this fireball. 
And we will go with... We'll do with that fireball twice. Do we want to do it twice? Yeah, we'll do it twice. So, the thing with this fireball, it does a lot of damage, but you only get one use out of it, then the card goes away. Right? Alright, so Reginald. Barrier. Go with that one once. Healing Reigns. We're going to make them so they only apply to us. It's mostly about the regen, and Dispelling Fire is nice, I guess. Barrier, we'll do this one. We'll do this one. Spell Magic, we will upgrade because granting two buffer is amazing. Splash, we will make free. We will make this Splash draw a card. Splash heal, just make it better. You gotta be careful with your heals, especially. You don't want them to have vanish, or at least you don't want too many of them to have vanish. Um, heal, let's make, see this. So if we had taken this variant and then this variant for our heals, we could potentially get in a situation where we'd had very few heals left in our deck. So you gotta be careful with that. We can make this cheaper. That's like almost all of our shards, but we're almost, we're good, I think. Let's, uh, let's upgrade a Sunbeam. Yeah, we're ready to go here pretty much. Actually, 51 shards exactly. Let's upgrade our Holy Smite. All right, we're ready. We're ready to do this. Let's get out there and get at it. So, what way do I want to go? Oh, what is this? Oh, this is the Caravan. We're going to go this way to check out the Caravan. Because I've never done the Caravan before. Come across the caravan of pilgrims resting by the roadside. After talking to them, they offer to take you wherever you want to go for a modest fee. Oh. Oh. You can skip stuff. Huh. I feel like I want the experience, though. I'm not so far along that I can skip this stuff, I don't think. Well, I guess I'm committed to going up, so we will do... So we'll do we'll do the hatch. We'll head towards the hatch. I know I did the hatch in my last run, but the hatch is good. I did it for a reason. <laughs> right? Alright, so let's do deflect first. Uh, and then let's mark. Mark again. Hit it again. Might as well cast adrenaline. Let's trace on him. Rage is good. Okay, we don't need this many blocks, I don't think. Alright, so let's see what we draw here. So let's see, we'll draw one more card. Okay, Piercing Hell is good. That's kind of what we were hoping for. So now, they're slow. So I can kill the front monster. Hit the next front monster. Defend. Defend. Intercept. I don't know. One of them might. This guy should get a turn, but I don't think this one will. Yeah, he's in trouble. <laughs> Ooh, what do we want to do here? So let's do a fireball here. And then an ember storm. And then a fire blast. Yeah, we didn't even need uh <laughs> didn't even need old Reginald. Alright, so we get some upgraded cards. Helping hand. Grant one inspire. Spells slow, spells uh, insane. And that's not self, that can be played on anybody. But I also kind of want the punch, so I'm going to take the punch. Quick shot, deals 13 to the front monster. That's not bad. Can it upgrade into any monster? No, it has to be front. Apply 4 poison to all monsters. For cost of 0. I'm just going to take the shards. Like, I see where that's good. But it's more of a... If you have a dedicated poison deck, it's more good. We're, we're not doing ice. Deal X. Shadow damage. X equals your discard pile. Okay, well that certainly could be good. But I want to I want to stay focused with the fire. What do we got? We got an upgraded heal. Scry, healing rain. Hmm. Upgrade a heal might be good. 
We'll go shards. We're not going to need heals for a bit. <laughs> right? So. So I'm not going to worry about heals right now. Pops on fire. Near the farm, you come across a burn field and a burning house. In front of the house, there's a fire imp causing fires next to some burning cornies. Even half burn, the house makes things something valuable. So we have to deal with the fire imp and cornies first. Attack the imp head on. Fight in the cornfields and attack him by surprise. Continue your way without attracting the attention. No, we're going to fight. Can we get it lower than six? Sure, let's try. Yep, definitely lower than six. All right, so we had no problem hiding in the cornfields without him seeing you. When he least expected, you come out of the shadows and strike him with a good blow. The imp is stunned. It starts to bleed. The fight begins. So you should have some bleeds on him. Yeah, and he's slow. Indeed, exactly what, exactly what they said would happen. So we'll deflect first. Oh man. So we're going to do that because that's a really good card. And then we're going to ricochet there. Yeah. All right, no, that did well. I like that. Well, that kills him. Uh, yeah, let's take out the corny first since he's so slow. All right, what do we got here, Magnus? Let's slow everybody down. And, uh, yeah. Do that. Do that. Punch him in the face. He's dead. I don't think the Sim's going to get a turn. Because even if he does, he's taking 8 damage at the start of his turn from the bleed. Nope. Oh, he's got really high fire resistance, though. 54%, so that makes it a little tougher. Yeah, he's still dead. <laughs> Even if Reginald doesn't draw any damage. But he did. Easy peasy. Alright, so we've got some upgraded cards here. Oh, this is pretty good. I do like this card. 26 block is a lot. And it does not remove it at the end of the turn. Intercept. Helping. I'm going to take this card. Gain one stanza. Place one song from your hand on top of your deck. I'm not doing songs, really. So we will do... That's good, but it's expensive. So we'll do shards. Ice Lance, no. Inner Combustion, no. I do like this card, but not that much. Um, Grant 13 shield and 3 stacks of courage. But I find they don't do Mind Holy and Shadow damage all that much. That's too expensive for this point in the game. Grant one inspire, look at five, discard any of them. That's pretty good. I'm just gonna take the shards, I think. All right, so let's rush into the house, try to get the chest out. We need higher than three, and if we fail, we'll get itchy burn cards in our deck, I, I believe. Easy. 80 gold, 56 experience, nice. And we get a chest. Nothing too crazily good here, but I mean, max HP 6, sure. Take the gold from him. And we'll take the gold from him. Heal done plus one. We're hoping to get a better weapon for him eventually, but hey, better than nothing right now, right? Alright, so yeah, we're going to. Do we want to do the hatch? Or I want to get this. I've never done this quest. I'm not even sure what I need to do. Yeah, let's go. Let's go get this quest. Something different. Oh, we got a corruption. All monsters gain damage plus one, and they gain damage and heal done plus five. Gain access to an upgrade altar. Let's take the golden shards. We'll do it. I don't expect them to get many turns. So the damage won't matter. He is a healer, though. But we'll leave him. He can heal, hopefully, nobody. We'll start with a ricochet. And aim shot you. Aim shot you. And kill you. And we'll look at your cards. Piercing Howl is what we wanted to see. It's actually a pretty good hand. We will keep it. So Piercing Howl obviously coming out. So now we all get to go. We will enrage. We'll shield bash. 
and we will punch. And then we'll defend, and defend, intercept. Alright, so how much damage are we going to do here? Well, let's fireball this guy, kill him, do some damage to the sides. Or scroll of intellect on him, give him a better turn. And then Searing Touch. I guess it doesn't really matter which Searing Touch I do. He might be dead, depending on what he draws. And he does get to draw next card, thanks to that Scroll of Intellect. No, oh, he did not draw much damage. Unfortunate. So let's get some shields up here. Barrier there. Oh, he's just going to heal, so it doesn't matter. Whatever, I'll let him heal. <laughs> Oh no, whatever am I going to do now? I guess I probably should just kill him. Easy peasy. Alright, so we got some upgraded cards. Let's take a look. Sweeping Strike is a good card, but we're trying to focus on crushing, so we're going to pass. I am going to take the Burning Shot, because we're going with a Fire Deck. Speaking of Fire Deck, this is a really good card though for two cost but I'm trying to keep my deck nice and tight right oh I gotta take the sacred bolt though that's really good value for one yeah that's good that was worth it alright so let's see what this quest is you enter a nearby water mill it seems empty at first Lance then you hear a whisper directed at you you aren't my praise you were scaring them leave please Wait a second. If you happen to find a very strong venom and give it to me, I will join your group after I finish this job. Okay. So obviously that's in the swamp. Yeah, Aqua from all shares a cave full of spiders. Maybe there. Take this. The spoils of my victims. It helps for your search. Alright, so I know where the, the spider cave is. So I know where I need to go for that. Alright, what do we got here? Alright, well he's got a full of stuff already so we'll just take the money and poison darts yeah take the money you know what? I think I'm just gonna take the money everywhere yeah we'll give him some, some max HP he's pretty low max HP and we'll take the money for him too all right what do we got here all resistances plus 10%. That's kind of annoying. They start with block and even more resistances. Magnus will get Furious Slash card for free. Deal X, supply X, X equals your Fury. Okay, well that's good if you're doing a Fury deck. Or I can remove one card from my deck. I don't want to remove any cards yet, so I'm just going to skip it. I know I could get extra, you know, score from it, but meh. Alright, so let's deflect. Oh, we got some expensive cards here, but some good ones. Yeah. We got a pretty expensive deck. <laughs> Piercing Howl is nice. Ooh, they're still faster, because these guys are pretty slow. Let's punch you. Pommel. Another pommel. And I will block on myself, I guess. Alright, so... We finally get hit. We're finally going to have some healing to do. That's fine. It was inevitable that eventually we would have to heal. We got to get old Cornelius' speed up here. <laughs> Desperately. Alright, so that burned through most of the... The, uh, shield he had. Speaking of expensive decks. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. I like that. Now let's just finish off this front guy. And we will scroll the intellect on Reggie. Let's go, Reggie. See me. Show me what you got. Alright, so let's uh some healing rain. Get some healing rain. I mean it's free. Heal on him, I guess. Heal on him. <laughs> Heal there. And 
barrier. Sure. It doesn't really matter. Blacked. Blacked. Adrenaline. Now we can cast everything. Let's do a ricochet. Boom, boom, boom. You're dead. Strap and shot you. Slice. Now let's take a look at Magnus' stack. See if we can get some damage to finish him off. So we won't take that. We'll take the other ones, though. Yeah, he should be dead. I think. So yeah, let's heal. Yeah, we don't even need to heal, but whatever. Take down his resistances. Shield bash. Shield bash. And victory, we are full again. Alright, what do we got here? Nothing good for Magnus, so let's just take shards. Another ricochet. Choir stands a one, which we don't really have. Four powerful for zero cost. That's pretty good. One of these, one of these times, I will have to try a song deck, but it is not this time. Uh, none of these really help us, and none of those really help us. That's hey, it's two hundred forty shards. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? We don't need to heal. Find some gold or shards. Can we get lower than three? Let's try. Or lower than six, sorry. Not lower than three. Uh-oh. Nope. We failed. Now we still get 240 shards. Oh, I don't get any bad cards for that? Oh. Okay. Well, we're going to go up here. We're going to do this mini boss. Fungal Outbreak. Oh, I don't like this one. I don't like the Magic Mushroom. I think I'm going to skip this one. As much as... As good as that is, and that is too, don't get me wrong. Oh man, that's tempting though. Yeah, I'll get two extra damage. It's the magic mushroom that sucks. Hmm. Discover three range attack and place one on top of your deck. Yeah. You know what? I'm just going to skip it. I know. I know. I'm not being very brave. <laughs> I'm sorry. Right, let's hit this first. We'll do a ricochet and see where that leaves us. Okay, so we can finish off the front guy. Let's do that. And let's take a look at Magnus' stack. And we'll get rid of the pulverize. It's a little expensive for what it does at this point. Well, he's going to have a lot of block. <laughs> but nobody else is going to have much of any. Hopefully they have some front, <laughs> some front hero stuff. Yep, sure do. That's a lot of buffs. A heal and another buff. All right, well, they didn't even attack, so I guess the no block thing wasn't a big deal. And I draw these fireballs a lot, it seems. Oh, sorry. There we go. And scroll of intellect on him. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Oh, we got some damage this time. Definitely got some damage this time. So he's going to die. Now we must well just kill him. I mean, he would die on his turn, but... Meh. But they, between the two of them, they're going to have, have something that's going to be front monster, so we might as well just kill him now and then deal with it later. Put Hunter Merch Mark on the back guy. No, well, yeah, that's pretty good little turn we got right here. Let's do let's do the back guy first. Yep, yeah, and he's dead. 
He's getting close to dead. We may be able to kill him here. Mm. See what I draw. Yeah, that should do it. Pommel. Punch. I guess we had it anyway. Excellent performance. Ooh, leveled up Heavy Strike. Leveled up Punch. Hmm. You know what? I'm just going to take the shards. Just going to take the shards here, I think, too. Yeah. This is upgraded. Deal 2, apply 2, chain 1. Nah. I mean, that's not bad, but nah. And Benediction. Upgraded Benediction is pretty good. I think I'm going to take that. There we go. All right, so yep, we're gonna go up here, do the do the do the boss, and that'll be that'll be it for this first video. Fresh meat. When entering the bandit camp, you see a really big werewolf yelling and giving orders to other werewolves. He notices your presence and looks at you with a mocking face. That's Yager, the butcher of Sinentia, has been terrorizing the Sinentia forest for a long time. It's time to put a stop to Yager and disperse the bandits once and for all. I can just fight him. I can run. I'm not gonna run. Or I can try to get a lower than two with Magnus. I don't know. I don't think that's good. So I'm just gonna fight. He has too many things that are two or higher in the stack. Got one, two, three, four. Eh, only four. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. I'll just fight. We're fine. We don't need any bonuses, I don't think, to, to take this guy out. Reflect. Reflect. Oh, this is a good hand. Adrenaline. This is a really good hand. It's mark first, then vulnerable, then mark again. Yeah, he's yeah, he's taking some damage. If I was faster, he wouldn't even get a turn. But unfortunately, I'm not fast enough. Hit him with that. It's enraged. See what else we get. Oh, still, so we're still a little too slow, but it was close. But yeah, he's got like no resists left though. So we'll do that, do that, and we'll do that. So he's gonna get one turn here. Oh, I forgot that he can heal. Or er, forgot that he can summon. That's fine. I think if we kill him, we don't have to kill the ads. I think. I've drawn this fireball. My opening hand every single time, I feel like. So let's hit, uh, we gotta hit the front monster with that, but we can hit Yager with that. And we can hit Yager with that. So we're going to. Alright, what'd you get? Did you get any damage? Yeah, you did. Not a whole lot, but definitely some. Yeah, he's on the edge there now. Now right, let's get some barriers up, I guess. I don't think we need to heal, no. All right, I don't know. I was gonna say the problem is gonna be getting stuff that actually hits the back monster. <laughs> oh, let's see what this says here. Oh, it did go back to him. Nice. Yeah, we don't have to kill the ads. So that was really quick. What is this? Gain X shield. X equals your deck times four. Gain one inspire. Well, that'd be potentially that could be a lot. That could be like 80 block. But <laughs> All right now we're gonna take plus. Remember how we thought about taking this at the start? We're gonna take it now. So we're getting a little farther along. Poisonous blood, scavenge. No. Oh, oh, here's some flame stuff. Wow, that's expensive. Good, <laughs> but it's too expensive. Two. Deal four, apply one, jump twice. Yeah, let's do that. Let's take that. That's extra fire stuff. I do like binding heal. We already got one upgraded benediction. I just like this card. So we're going to take it. And we took three cards there. Oh, and we got a level up in, which was nice. So let's see what we got for loot here. 240, 240, 
a little bit of XP, some upgrade materials, some level ups, and we still have a chest on top of that as well. That sometimes has good things in it. Not so much today, though, I don't think. We need to get the weapon with him for blunt. Like, this is good, but not in our deck. Not for what we're trying to do. I do like this Piercing Howl card, though. I might take that on on somebody. One of these people. Um, Yeah, I'm just taking the money here, I think, too. So who do I want to take this on? Probably him, because he needs the max HP more than he does. Yeah, and we'll take the money here. And we could do the round shield. It's 75 gold. Yeah, let's do the round shield. Why not? Well, the reason why not is to take the gold instead, but we're not going to worry about that. Um, Speed or max HP? I'm going to go speed, actually. I want to make sure he stays faster, because I want to get those blocks out. And we will do some extra energy from him. Resistances, one inspire, John, one extra card. Let's do that. And for him, let's do speed. All right. So we are ready to fight the boss, but that will be in the next episode. If you enjoyed this episode, please let me know in the comments. Leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, join my Discord. Be good to each other. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.